And holding the glove properly becomes very important when we learn how to receive the baseball properly. Infielders receive the ball differently than any other position player on the field. And we do that first from a thumb up position with my hands extended off of my body where my elbows stay away from the body. That basic receiving position will be my knees bent, my chest slightly forward, and the body's basic athletic position. But my elbows extended off of my body and in with my thumbs up in a V-shape. That receiving position allows my hands to be independent off of my body where if my elbows get to my body line, now my hands have hit a roadblock, they have nowhere to go, and then my hands become hard. We want the hands to be able to work freely out in front of my body. We do this by catching only half of the baseball. Players, when they first start playing catch at a young age, usually catch the ball in the easiest place to receive it, and that's in the web. Well, you do that, you catch the whole ball, and that's usually in a thumb down position. Everything we're trying to do as an infielder is about cutting down time and distance. Well, one of the easiest ways to cut down time is in the exchange. So when we receive in a thumb up position, that allows us to catch half of the ball in the flat surface of the glove or the pocket, keeping it out of the web. And then it's my glove fingers that come to my bare hand to make a quick exchange out of the glove. Which means every time I receive a ball between my shoulders or near, I need to receive the ball with two hands, not just to secure the catch, but to make a quicker exchange. For more tips, classes, clinics, private lessons, or even live lessons on Skype with your computer, visit us at EliteBaseballTraining.com.